this is Zulala, and today I'm going to do a two-part review. First, on the Sony Bloggy, which I'm actually using right now to film this. And secondly, on my contacts. They are the Nudie Blue 14.5. They are Geo contacts. So first we'll start out with the camcorder. It's like a flip camcorder thingy. <laughs> and I showed you the box right, but I'll show you again. It's the Sony Bloggy. And we'll show you the other side. So here's the side. Here's the back. It's boring. And here's another side. Yay! <laughs> so, uh, I bought this today at Walmart for $160. Pretty good. I'm really enjoying it too, so yeah. So you get this cute little box, and then inside it is another box. Whoa! Crazy. <laughs> and then you open this little box, and right here would be where your bloggy is sitting, all cute and brand new. Then you take out the little velvet thing, and all the papers that come with it will be stuffed in here. <laughs> and a little USB cord. Mm, yeah, pretty cute. Uh, well, what I really like about the Sony Bloggy is it's really easy to use. You just press the record button, record, stick it into your copy, then you register it, you install the program. It's very self-explanatory and there's no, I don't know where I put the directions, but the directions are really nice because it just has pictures. It doesn't like have a bajillion words or anything. It's really simple. And um, yeah, so that's great. So easy to use, really nice. Um, it's also really good in the low light. Like right now, it's oh 4:35, so that's a.m. 4:35 a.m. So there's no natural lighting, and I have three lights set up around me. This one, which is really more for decoration, but it, you know, helps. One behind it, which you could probably actually see the reflection when I held up the box. <laughs> And then this little wand light, it's kind of like a lightsaber. Yeah, I won't flash it directly at you though, it's pretty bright. Um, it's got like a flexible thing here and it's got a magnetic bottom, so if I happen to have metal around, I guess I could hang it up. <laughs> yeah, um, eh, I like it, it's cute. I just sit it here and keep it here a little bit just for some extra light. The color doesn't match, so you're probably like, oh, this side of her face is like a bluish color and this side's yellow, and who knows what's going on with the front, but yeah, <laughs> whatever. One thing I don't really like about the bloggy though is it only records in MP4 format. So how do I edit it? Windows Movie Maker doesn't support MP4 format. And I'm sure there's gotta be something out there. I did try VideoPad, uh, VideoPad video editing software, but I don't like the layout. It's all like crammed together. I'm like, what's going on? And I found that sometimes when I clip parts of the movie, the sound, like my voice, is off from the actual motion, the actual video. So then I'm like, okay, I don't know. It's probably something I'm doing wrong, but I just like things to be simple. I just want to be able to look at it and go, yes, that's how it works. I, I don't want to read the manual. I really don't. <laughs> um, yeah, so I did try converting the MP4 to like AVI or something else, but then I lose all my quality and that's sad. I might as well be recording with a camcorder then, or a um, webcam. <laughs> I might as well be recording with a webcam. And no, I'm good. <laughs> but, like I said, super easy to use. It's light. It lasts for two hours at a time. You charge it by sticking it into your computer. Yeah. And I guess that's all I really have to say about it. It's pretty good. So, we'll move on to the contact. So you probably 
can't see the color from back here, so I will move up closer to the camera. But first, I will show you the bottle it came in. So here it is, and I always see people putting their hands behind the stuff, so that must help, right? <laughs> Here's the bottle. Yay. And then there's a little sticker at the bottom too. Yay. <laughs> and I got these contacts from geosupplier.blogspot.com. Yeah, so here is a close up. I hope you can see it. Uh, they're pretty comfortable all in all to wear obviously to wear <laughs> but after five or six hours you are ready to take them off these are quite large they're the largest you can buy so oxygen doesn't get to your eye as well with these gigantic thick contacts on so after five six hours it feels like your eyes are wearing a sweater in summer and that's not very pleasant <laughs> uh, and plus I wouldn't recommend wearing them that for any longer than that because it's important to get oxygen to your eyes. Hmm. I kind of wish that the ring wasn't so thick around the edges because I really enjoy a halo effect and I don't think these give as much of a halo effect as I would enjoy because the ring is so thick. Most of the white in my eye isn't showing through the blue. Hmm, I also wouldn't mind if they were a little bluer, but I'm pretty happy with the color. And I like the the texture, I guess. Textile? I'm not sure. I like the pattern that's on them. I wouldn't mind trying out the gray. And these are really big for my eyes. I've seen some people are able to pull off the 14.5, and it doesn't look weird on them, but me, it just makes me look like an alien, which is kind of what I'm going for right now. Hmm, I probably won't wear these out and probably freak people out. <laughs> um, I don't think I have anything else to really say about them. Let you enjoy the color a little. Try not to move around. <laughs> Yeah, so there you have it. A short review on contacts and camcorder. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed it and yeah, I should be all like and going to bed. I should have went to bed hours ago, but I'm just not sleepy. Don't stay up late like me. It's not good for you. <laughs> Alright, good night. <laughs>